What's up guys, Spin Firearms here, and we are finally here. My new Glock 26 build. This thing is beautiful. I just want to start off by saying, one, I used a frame from a different Glock 26 build I have because I'm still waiting for my frame to come in. Um, and also, I'm waiting for my handle at Edge Series Grips to throw on some of my Glocks as well. So, this is an older frame with Talon Grips. I don't like these Talon Grips. But for the purpose of showing you guys the build, I'll show you this. It turned out awesome. Now there was some things that were a little hard when it comes to um, building it is trying to imagine the color coordination and stuff like that without actually seeing the um, slide and stuff like that in person. Also the barrel looked a little different in pictures but it looks sweet. So anyways this is my new Glock 26. This thing is beautiful. This is one of those builds where you would just want to take it, put it in a picture frame and put it on your wall. This thing is beautiful. And so I didn't spare anything. And what's sad about this video is I'll make no money on this video. It'll be demonetized, but I'm doing it basically to show you guys, keep you guys updated. Um, and honestly, this is one of my most expensive builds. And like I said, I'll make nothing off these videos about it, but it is what it is. You know, it comes with the game, I guess. Anyways, gun cut slide. And I told them, I just want something awesome. You know, do, you know, work your magic. And so they took care of it. As you can see, beautiful Cerakote job. I mean, this looks just perfect. Um, I did get it a little dirty. It was very nerve wracking putting the sights on, especially with the new Cerakote and, you know, putting certain parts on with the paint job. And it just, it, it's awesome. They did a beautiful job. Then I have a gray ghost precision barrel. Heard very good things about this. As you can see the cut in the slide. Look at, I mean, look at this. It is flawless. The work they did is flawless. And since some people under my comments were like, you need to try out fiber optic sights, I got a Mariglow fiber optic sights with a blacked out rear. I'm really starting to like blacked out rears. I'm not sure why that is, but I'm starting to like it and just what my eye picks up. Got a Springer precision base plate. And then right here is those red pin kit. And honestly, this didn't all come in as a set. I had to match these and I had to buy a couple different parts over again, trying to get it matched. And yeah, it turned out good. I was very nervous once I saw the slide. It's, they didn't do a bad job, they did an awesome job, but I was nervous about the red that I got. But the thing came together perfect. This thing is beautiful. We're gonna be shooting it at the range. Oh yeah, don't, don't let me forget. All Glock internals except for a two pound, um, crap, I'm blanking on what brand it was. Ah, oh, come on, come on, come on. It's not Wilson Combat, a two, oh, Zev, Zev. It's a two pound Zev trigger connector. It makes the trigger pull around three and a half pounds to four and a half pounds, somewhere in there. And it's just perfect, nice and short. Um, great feel to it. But anyways, yeah, that is my new Glock 26 build. Gun Cuts did an amazing job on the slide. I'm so excited with how it turned out. Yeah, thanks for watching guys. Let me know in the comments what you think of it. 